G'day guys, this is Booze Review, the show where we review the booze. So I apologise for the birds in the background, not much I can do, they're bloody everywhere. You know, lorikeets, minor birds, all that. But I guess it may fit into the uh, theme of this beer. We have Leo Lager Beer. This one here is 5% ABV in this rather nice chocolate 330ml bottle. So yeah, Leo is a classic Thai beer brand brewed in Bangkok, Thailand. Not sure when it was first introduced, um, but the brewery itself was Thailand's first brewery, basically, the one that brews this, so... I assume it's, you know, it's been around for a while. So yeah, I have had this before, not too bad, I got it from Aldi. Uh, $21 for a 12-pack. Pretty good value right there. So yeah, I'm not sure if I ever had this in Thailand, I think I probably have. But uh, yeah, I'm just uh, gonna crack it open and give you my thoughts. Right that cool bottle top by the way you know classic leo and pour it into my good old classic beer glass that i've been using for quite some time now there we go so that's it in the glass there very pale very pale golden color a lot of carbonation as you can see there a lot of carbonation maybe about two three centimeters of bright white frothy head there yeah let's go for the aroma now shall we definitely a multi sweet multi smell just a typical lager smell overall so you're at five percent this is a full strength lager so yeah, anyway guys, I think it's high time that I give Leo a little try. Cheers, cheers. <sighs> Definitely a full strength lager here guys at 5%. It's refreshing, it's crisp. It's reasonably well balanced. Yeah, not too bad overall. Yeah, get a nice sweet malty smell and taste, obviously. Yeah, not too bad overall. Let's go for another gulp, shall we? Ah, yeah, pretty good overall, guys. Not much else I can really say about it. Definitely tastes better than what I thought it was. You know, last time I had it in Thailand, I wasn't, you know, particularly impressed by it from what I can remember. But uh, yeah, nice ice cold out of the fridge. Nothing wrong with Leo, man. It goes well. Is it, you know, the, the crispest, you know, most refreshing beer out there? No. But, you know, for a Thai beer, it's pretty bloody good. Nothing wrong with it, guys. Yeah. So that's Leo from Aldi. Yeah. Pretty good overall. Not really much lacing on the glass there. Let's go for another gulp, shall we? Yeah, pretty good overall, guys. Sorry about the sound quality. I'm sure it's abysmal. Yeah, I mean, there is just there is just a million lorikeets just on the... Yeah, let me, let me give you a look at this, all right? I'm going to flip this, all right? Let's have a little look at this bullshit, okay? This is... You know what I mean? Like, did you just see that? Like, for God's sake. But I've got to deal with some bombs. Did you see that flight of birds? Far out. You know, and I've got a bloody dog here and a cat there. Oh well. So anyway guys, I think it's high time that I give Leo a final sip and a final score. Cheers to you. Overall, it's a decent full strength lager from Thailand. Pretty good value from Aldi. 12 for $21. I uh, imagine it would be even cheaper over there of course. Yeah, not bad overall, guys. I know Thai beers sometimes kind of cop a bit of flack. They're definitely, you know, not the best in general. But I tell you what, ice cold, mate, in a hot climate, nothing wrong with it. Leo gets an 8 out of 10 for me, guys. Yeah, so um, if you like that video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you want. And, uh, yep, sorry about the shit show of an episode that this is. But, oh, well, just the way it is, I guess this kind of, you know, fits into the tropical climate that you would drink Leo in. Excuse me. Anyway, guys, see you later.